a number of us got rashes on our hands, for example, that, you know, you go into the doctor and they tell you it's a fungal infection, you know, and ironically enough, you know, 10 months later, I've taken all, everything that they prescribed and you still have it, as well as everybody else still has it. Um, you know, but one of the things that we ran into out there in dealing with the oil is that, you know, the, although you were supposed to be provided with, you know, protective gear, you know, our protective gear really boiled down to a hard hat and life jacket and steel toed boots. There's a situation where, you know, BP says everyone has to wear protective gear, and if you're working on the beach with the cameras nearby, that's what you did. I think, you know, uh, for subcontractors and everybody else, you know, it's, it's a little harder to, to get protective gear, to put it that way. Um, you know, and so you know, there are more days than I can count with oil all over us, you know. Just in that capacity of that job, that's what you did. Um, you know, you had oil everywhere. If you were pressure washing oil off the deck, you were breathing it in. You could feel it coating your skin and, and oil. And, and, you know, and now we know dispersants mixed in as well. Um, you know, and when you're out laying boom out there, you know, when you're connecting anchors to the boom and everything else, your arms are in the water every day. You know, so it's really no protective gear when you're in the water. You know, doing your heart jumps to you know, beating 140, 160. And it lasts for hours, and it's so irregular. It wakes you up all night long, you know, and just then, then, then started to come brain fogs. And the, the brain fogs are, they're wild because all of a sudden everything just goes. You, you can't focus, you can't think, your, your body's shaking uncontrollably. Uh, I've got perfect vision, but your vision starts to go. And it lasts for hours and hours where, you know, I've had times where I'm on a kitchen floor laying down 20 minutes, half hour. I have no idea what's going on. I can't speak clearly anything. And, um, you know, among a, a lot of other things, um, I mean, the symptoms just go on and on. The headaches that, that have come and, you know, and the infections, you know, the, the infections that run your entire body, you get a tiny scratch and it swells up to the size of a golf ball. And then the next... A little spot swells up, and then you know, carotid artery right here, it's still, still swelling, you know, swells up. And so it just, it, it, you know, every day is a new day of. That's like part of the problem was trying to figure out what to do, you know, because I talked to professional after professional after professional, they had no idea. Because what we found is that once you're exposed to this, when you have it in your system, it makes you very susceptible.